What's up guys, Josh here with JCS Customs. Got my new bud here, Zach. What's going on? He's got a 2021 Camaro 1LT. He just purchased two days before Christmas in 2022. We're actually gonna be installing the ZL1 1LE wing on this beautiful shock colored 2021 Camaro here. Right now, as you see, he's got a aftermarket like matte black RS lip spoiler here. We're gonna take that off and he's gonna join the big wang gang as like people like to call it. So let's put this thing on here. This is the most annoying thing I've ever done in my life. <laughs> Let me see if I'm there. They're good. Cool. Sometimes when you go to do it, it'll just pop out and swing. <laughs> swing off. So what we're going to do is like, talk about the dinner. You're just going to take these out. This just slips out. Oh, one more. Once you got this off, you're going to want to take all these little, I call them rubber grommets. This one here. And then that's it on the back. So, so, open. Okay. It actually looks like some of your tape to look it up. Maybe a little bit. This side, first here at this front right corner. Yeah, that's the same way it is on the side. Did you get your, uh, your Chevy uh, plate? Okay. It was actually from AutoZone. Yeah, that's that's what takes a while. <laughs> All right, so I want you to stick this back in your box. So people in Mobile do fill these holes. Yeah, you gotta find a good body shop. I mean, it's a pain because what they'll do is most of them, because I looked into this a lot because it bothered me. Mm -hmm. Is they'll weld a plate in the bottom of it, fill it in with Bondo filler and sand it down and repaint your whole trunk. Not just that portion. I'm gonna see how it looks when we're done and then decide how urgently this needs to happen. Okay, the clip didn't come out. I have some microfiber towels in the trunk. Okay. It's gonna be easy, this peels up. What is this? Is this tape? Yeah, it's really young. All right, so we just took all of that off. The big pain that is always with these cars is taking off all that 3M tape. We took it off. We used some of that cherry scented, awesome smelling uh, white diamond detail spray there sprayed that on there and it took it off a little bit better than the goo gone did what do you think about that zach i mean you said it yourself it was going to be tough but when you brought up that good smell of bubble gum something or another that made it 10 yeah. times easier i don't know where it is i don't know where i sat it but <laughs> yeah, that is amazing. looks good all right let's start on the wing All right, so we just got the wing put together, preliminary fit so we can stick it up here because unfortunately, like my car seen on the channel two years ago, we're gonna have to drill holes in this. Um, gonna have to drill a hole. Luckily, there's already pre-placed holes on the inside of the trunk for the two outer stanchions. The middle one here doesn't have a hole at all. So we're gonna have to drill two holes for those there. And you can't access that from the inside of the trunk, so we are gonna have to do it from the outside. And we're coming up with a way to best put a template there. So, let's get it. Yeah. All right, you good? Yep. Uh. There it goes. All right. 
very carefully and take them away. I'm not gonna wipe it off, so I'm just gonna kind of. <laughs> We're gonna save that for the next one. That's smooth, huh? Oh, yeah. See how easy that bends? Mm hmm. It's almost drilled a hole when it's going to reverse. <laughs> it goes that, in reverse the first <laughs> All right, about to put it on. We're going to apply some heat. Like always, if you watch my videos, you know I'm a believer in this, as others are. It made a huge difference. This is why you take lessons from a mechanic. <laughs> engineer. Ooh. Mechanical engineer sounds good together. Hopefully this tape works. If not, we'll put three in on. Just try to slide the screws just a little bit. Don't let the tape touch. Right, I'm in. That's it. I bolt this top bolt down. Let's see if it pulls it in. And we'll see. All right, guys, we got it on. It fit really nice once we got the holes drilled out just a little bit bigger. Pulled it down with the tape, and the tape stuck really, really nice. We got the winglet set on with JB Weld, six-minute set JB Weld. We are going to have to get these holes patched somewhere, though. It's only downfall, but that shouldn't be too big of a problem. So, what do you think, Zach? I love it. I mean, keep in mind, this tail is not supposed to come on this vehicle, so the way it turned out for it not being a ZL1, I mean, I love it. It looks, it looks really good on the shot. It looks great. It looks great on the shot. Awesome. Look at that, man. So yeah, guys, if you got a 1LT Camaro, now you can see what it looks like on these cars. I think it looks awesome. Just realized I forgot to make an outro, so here's this part of the video. Guys, the wing turned out awesome. It looks great. There were a few issues with the winglets, like they didn't want to line up properly and sit on the end of the wing. And this is what it was my first time installing an infinite aero product so there was a few issues with the winglets but uh overall the, the wing looks great now as you can see i also got the zl1 winnelly wing on my ss here and i love it um it looks great on his car he's got the matte black hood with the gloss black wing back there so we're actually going to do a full reveal of his wing on his car when we actually put the bumper on his car that we're going to do on the channel as well. So he's getting the ZL1 bumper through uh, American Muscle. So we're going to put that on here. So smash that subscribe button if you want to see that and keep up to date with that. And give me a like if you feel like it. So um, if you do want to see a full, really detailed install of the ZL1 1LE wing, go check out my other video on the channel. As you see the thumbnail picture popping up down below, go check that out. That is a fully detailed uh, review and install. So. Yeah, guys, got a full day of videos, mods planned, got a lot going on. So until next time, stay safe, have fun driving, peace out.